All cars checking in for tonight's event. Here we go. Jeff, it was uh, Jason Rogers starting on the outside and now taking the lead. Woken is in second, and the 8R of Nolan Remus third. Looking to the inside is the 56T of T Meyer for fourth. Armstrong gets tagged as he spins around and two more cars collected at the top of the track. A couple of the cars were trying to get to that high line. They'll come back to the green flag. Tight quarters down low, woken a little slow. Remus may have got a bump from behind, goes spinning, and oh, those brakes work for the nine of Trevor Thornton. You talk about inches from Thornton just careening into Remus and everybody, for the most part, seems to come away unscathed. Monroe Schmidt will not make it out for the restart either, and here comes Jason Davis to the green flag. Jason Rogers, excuse me, to the green flag. Remus second, T. Meyer third, and then a freight train of another 20 cars behind him. It is Rogers out to the front, and now Teammeyer off the pace. Everybody checks up, and we remain green. Teammeyer off the pace in that turn one and two, and now contact in three and four among many cars, and it looks like we'll stay good. Nichols up to third, started 12th tonight. Three wide going to the corner, four wide going into the turn three and four. Will this work out? Somehow, everybody stays straight. Cody Williams and now a couple of cars into each other. The 38 of Shalen Holloway. off the track. It'll be Jason Rogers to bring him back. Mike Nichols rockets to the outside. Got that starting spot and there he goes. Mike Nichols is going to jump into the outside but problems in the back of the pack. That is Cody Williams getting caught up with the 95 of Tyler Tipton. Tipton looked like he was going to go to the pits and then stops, and now the 91. Again, Jason Rogers, as Adam Armstrong catches the field at top speed. Tyler Tipton back out onto the track. Mike Nichols with another run, but can't quite make it stick. Three wide through three and four. Can we make this one work? Yeah, for now. Mike 
Nichols again heads to the high side, trying to get along Jason Rogers. Four wide out of two. Vanover and Tubbs side by side for the fourth spot. Tubbs will take it away. Rogers, Nichols, Remus slow out of two, allows Tubbs and Vanover to catch him. In the fourth and fifth position, Meisner in the 20M is sixth. Bador makes his way to the top 10, the 99B, as we hit halfway. Two completely different lines working for the front two. Jason Rogers in the 37, dives down to the inside. Now Mike Nichols thinks that might be a good idea. He'll try the inside line. Nichols back to the outside in one and two. He tries the low side in three and four, pulling up behind Jason Rogers in the 37. The battle for the lead is on. Nichols to the inside, holds the lead. New leader. Kyle Vanover to the inside of Tubbs taking over the fourth spot. And now Perry Meisner to the inside of Jeff Tubbs, looking for fifth. Tubbs back to sixth now, as T. Meyer has made his way back to seventh. Jason Rogers slides off the back side. That allows Nolan Remus to move up to the second spot. And Mike Nichols to expand his lead. Problems for the 37 of Jason Rogers coming to a stop at the high part of turn number two and caution is out. Jason Rogers having problems in three. Mike Nichols with a little trail of smoke to bring him back to the green flag. Kyle Vanover shoots to second place, gets around Remus. And Iowa and Nebraska take the top two spots. It's a little Big Ten battle going on. What a run by T. Meyer. Remember, he went to the back earlier, and he's all the way back up to fourth. Coming around this time, there will be two laps to go, and more smoke out of Nichols' car. There may not be much left of Mike Nichols' car by the time he gets done, but he's going to try to give it all for the win. Nichols out of three and four. More smoke shown as the white flag. Vanover got a peek to the inside. Vanover looking for that inside position. Can't make it stick for the final lap. They'll go into three and four. Rogers with the lead. The 19 KY Vanover slams it down low, but it looks like Nichols is going to hold on.
Here's how your top five will finish in the 20M. Harry Meisner in fifth, 56T. Great run for Justin Tiemeyer to come from the back of the pack after going to the pits. He makes it back to the fourth spot. Nolan Remus in the 8R finishes third. Kyle Vanover in the 19, runner up to the 63 of Mike Nichols. Round of applause out of Harlan, Iowa. Third win this year here for.